All right, let's talk about green pan. Chef Jeremy, I'll get on this side of you. And we're super tickled to bring you this set of fry pans from Green Pan that has ceramic and diamonds. Is that right, Chef Jeremy? Yes. So we're thrilled. I mean, you're going to see food just sheet away from the bottom of these pans. You're not going to have any worry about sticking. And what you're going to really see is great results because remember, this goes into your oven up to 320 degrees. I know oddly specific, but 320 degrees. So you're doing toppings for your hash. Maybe you're putting some fried eggs on top. Really fantastic. And no rivets for you to have to clean because when you have a pan with rivets, that's usually where the egg sticks when you make it, right? What we're going to do is show you a great set of fry pans. This is eight and 10 inches. Chef yeah. Jeremy, welcome back, of course. Hi. Good to see you as Good to always. See you. Thank you. Yeah. And you know, we love Green Pan. It's cooking with a conscience. And so, what Green Pan did in 2007 was said, we're going to make a great nonstick without using any of the traditional plastic coating. So this is actually made with ceramic and crushed diamonds. And why is that important? Well, because the ceramic allows you to do high heat, it gets a nice surface, but the diamonds allow you to use metal utensils so that it won't scratch. It hardens that surface. So again, cooking with the conscious, and then to clean it, you can just wipe these clean here. Let's see on my hand, I'll saw two. There it is. And I, I do love what you said. There are no rivets inside of here. So normally this is rivets, this is welded here on the back side. So if you're flipping things, it doesn't catch it and no food sticks in those rivets. In case you're wondering, yes. can I get a sear with a ceramic diamond infused nonstick? You absolutely oh. can. Look at these gorgeous steaks. Do you want to? I would be happy to. First, yep. let me flip them though because oh. I want everyone to see this beautiful sear that we're getting. This beautiful color that is not only great color but also great flavor on these beautiful steaks. So That's right. One there's two. And how about some potatoes? You know what I love too is that just next to that, it does come with the lid. Now, the lid's important when you're doing potatoes because you're going to get you're going to get to fry them, but you're also going to cook the inside of them by putting that lid on there. So, mm -hmm. you get the two the set how of two. A spoon. Oh, here. A spoon this, might be a little easier. Uh, there's a metal spoon you could use too. Let me see is that big enough? Be okay. A little better. And don't be afraid to use metal utensils. It's scratch resistant. It has a wonderful thermal on. It's all PFOA, PTFE. Lead cadmium free. Oh, and these are lightly seared. Well, uh, it, well, they're they're shallow pan fried. Shallow pan fried. That's right. Isn't that Beautiful. great? Though? Beautiful. Oh. And again, you want that lid on there so that you cook the inside of those mm. potatoes as well. You don't I'll have give to you a little them. tip. You want to make those potatoes extra delicious? Yeah. Put them in a Ziploc bag with olive oil and ranch salad dressing mix. Oh, hello. And let them marinate in your fridge for about an hour, and then put them in a in a skillet with a little olive oil or or olive um, avocado oil. Delish. Oh, wow. And you know the best thing here, though, too, David, is well, you just to clean it. You can put these in your dishwasher if you like, but you can also just wipe it clean. That's ready to cook on right That's there. That's ready I to cook that. on. Again, yeah. let's talk to you about colors. Okay. And I will tell you also that this has uh, beautiful handles. So all the pans are the same color. You're shopping by handle color. So up top, I've got this in white marble 800 in the white marble. Then I have it for you in lapis blue. 500 there. This is the black marble. 1300. Here's the black. Only 1200, most popular. Then I've got it for you in the uh, dark wood, 750, and the light wood, 750. Now, these can go in the dishwasher, yes? Yes, they can. And you could put them into, like you said earlier, the oven. I'm just going to put one of your gloves on. Oh, right. one of my happy dance gloves. In the kitchen Fantastic. with David gloves, yeah. And pull this out because what we have here, again, I love the nonstick. If you're cooking fish, if you're baking, is this like a baked ziti? A baked ziti right there, mm. finished off in the in the oven there. And again, this should, if everything goes right here, it should just oh, it will. pour right out like that. I mean, that is the beauty of green pan. Of course, to clean out the inside again, I just take a towel. Now let's bring Roro's mic up. Yeah, Roro, yeah, you yeah. have cooked baked ziti probably um, a lot. Very much, yes. Is it usually a stick to the dish, break your heart kind of situation? Of course, it's a break your heart situation. Usually in the glass dishes that you use, sticks like and it sticks like, like cement. And then the cleanup is a mess, and I hate it. You have to soak and it. And that's the reason why you don't really make it, or I don't. I you don't I, make it as much anymore. I try. I don't want to because it's such a disaster to make. This would like, just slid right clean. out of there. All you're going to do is wipe that pan clean. I see that. That's fantastic. And then you could go ahead and put your, your brajol in the skillet and, and, mm. and, and sear it before you put it in the <laughs> You're good, You man. know. You know. Come on now. Or, or take a look. How about if you want to flip? Oh, let me see if I get this little flip. There it is. 
And that's what's great. It has that nice angle. So if you flip things, if you flip eggs, or this is just a quesadilla I'm doing, it's a wonderful pan. Green pan is known to be the best when it comes to non-stick fry pans. Well, they really are the best. It's forgiving cookware, isn't it? It, it really it's is. It's the kind of cookware that you reach for, that you want to uh, do eggs in the morning, a grilled yeah. cheese sandwich for lunch, and maybe pork chops for dinner. Um, are those crepes that you're doing? I'm doing a crepe there. And it, I did, you know, I just brought this to heat, so I don't know if it's quite finished, but I didn't add any extra oil or butter in there. And let's just see. Okay, that'd be... Let that cook for a little bit more. I can see it's still a little soft on top. But how about we do some eggs? And while we're waiting, and notice that Chef Jeremy put no butter in that pan, no, no oil in that pan. That's right. And what I love about this is as it cooks, I can just run this along and look at that. Oh, it just peels. My gracious. That's the way you want to do eggs. Just let it cook. Let the nonstick do all the work for you. I just let that get hot and cook. Let me just turn this. Actually, this heat's off. It was on, that was ambient heat from the steak earlier. There you go. One thing about electric stovetops, when you turn them off, they're still hot as fire. Yeah, right. <laughs> so uh, that is uh, one little hazard. You know, I've been with QVC 750 years. Okay. And back in the early days, yeah. when we wanted to show how good a nonstick was, we'd either put cheese in the pan or eggs. Yeah. Because they're both naturally sticky. Naturally, you know what else? Oh, and caramel. We'd put a caramel in caramel, the Caramel, yeah. But like here, we just did a nice um, berry crumble here. And again, so you can bake with this, do, do breakfast, lunch, dinner, dessert inside it. It's very, very uh, versatile. But I also love it as a fish pan because I love doing fish skin side down. That will stick to any pan that's not, doesn't have good nonstick. So fish in here, I love it for that. And let me just. Are we running out of utensils? Uh, here, utensils. Again, I got a metal utensil because, again, you can see here that I'm going to take this. I spoon too, though. Okay. Oh, here you go. I'm just going to kind of roll oh this. Oh, my great. It's just rolling out. Just roll it out. Roll it out. And there was no butter added. No to this butter, pan. No, no oil, oil nothing, no nothing like that. And I could take this and just roll. Where I'm, I'm going to put it on top. Sorry, I'm running out of space, but just roll that right onto my. Put it on top of the there. frittata. Isn't that great? Frittata. Mm. And that's the beauty of green pan is this is, and I, I like the eight inch pan. This is really my egg pan. So if you want to do one egg, two eggs, it's a perfect size for that. And this is that 10 inch pan. Perfect for a couple of steaks. Two pans Tons. under $50. There's an eight and a 10 inch. These are both open skillets, no lids on these. Yes. Important to know that this is a ceramic nonstick infused with diamonds. Oh, do we get one lid? I'm going to beg your pardon. We do get a lid. Forgive me. Yes, you get a lid. There is That's a right. lid with the largest, with the 10 inch, right? Yes. I, and I knew that there was a lid and I just completely forgot. All right, so this is your 10 inch lid, 10 inch pan, 8 inch pan, no lid. Okay? And this color is called white marble. This color is blue marble, or lapis blue is what I'm trying to say. Fewer than 500. This is black marble, and if you want just black, 1100. This is dark wood, and then finally light wood on the end. Chef Jeremy. Yes, sir. Great job, young man. Thank you. Honestly Fantastic. Pleasure. And I'm so tickled with your with your uh, 14 pounds down. That's great. Thank you. Thank you Every for the inspiration. Every single Seriously. week, yeah. it's more. It is. That's I hope exciting. so. That's pretty exciting. I hope so. Well, it's more this week than it was last week. It is, yeah. Last week, weren't you 10? 10. And now you're 14. Now I'm 14. How about that, young man? Thank you, buddy. <laughs> good for you. Thank you for that starting. That is so awesome. Happy to, so good. to 